Hi, so she's Alina, just welcome to my channel. This is your reading for the next week. Let's see what we have for you, so she's Alina. A message for Sagittarius. We have feelings. Okay. And we have success for you. Stay focused on your goal, your objective. Success is coming. What do you need to focus for the next week, Sagittarius? The Knight of Cups. So Knight of Cups is some um, very romantic coming for you, Sagittarius. Let's see what you don't see coming is the Key of Cups. The Key of Cups is someone very supportive, very loving, caring. Maybe this person has water in his shot, Cancer Pisces Scorpio. There is a lot of love here coming for you. Let's see. A message for Sagittarius for the next week. Queen of Hearts. This person sees you very attractive. Okay, your energy is beautiful at this time, Sagittarius. You are taking action in your life. You're feeling good, strong, okay? So, Queen of Wands is talking about creativity and passion, okay? Let's see. It's here, Knight of Cups, the same cards. You can see this person is offering you love. Six of Pentacles. It's balance in your relationship. Time for you to be generous. And it's also time for you to open your heart to receive this love. Two of Wands. It's like you are thinking about your future, making plans. You need to take action in your life, okay? Two of Pentacles, you're going to make a decision because your life needs balance also. Maybe you are to focus on something, Sagittarius. I Princess by this energy. Trust your interest or your intuition, I'm sorry. Trust your instinct. See, I Princess, she knows everything, okay? And we have the Six of Swords. The Six of Swords is you deciding to move in a new direction because you want peace in your life. For some of you, someone is going to help you. Let's see. Where's the Queen of Wands? your energy. Why is the Queen of Wands of Sagittarius? Ten of Swords. 
So ten of swords is like something is ending in your life because it was a lot of pain, a lot of progress. But I feel like you're feeling good about this ending, okay? Now you have your power back, Sagittarius. Let's see. Time for you to have success with the Knight of Cups. With the Knight of Cups, Sagittarius. For what? Wow. This person wants to have a stable relationship with you. So four fronts is stability relationship, balance. It's my ash card. You're going to celebrate something for the next week. This is six of pentacles. Why is this six of pentacles? Trying something new, really exciting. Feel like it's about this new connection in your life. of Wands. Why is the Two of Wands? So Fool, for some of you, you are going to move to travel, Sagittarius. Because we have the Six of Swords, is yes, also talking about movement. With the Two of Wands, you can see the world here. And with the Fool, it's yes, like you are taking a leap of faith trying something new, really exciting. It's a new cycle in your life. Let's see, where's the two of pentacles? Where's the two of pentacles? That's the moon card, Pisces, Cancer Energy. Yes, talking about fertility, your intuition, Yes, also time for you to face in your fear, Sagittarius, because the moon is illusion, your dream, your fear. Let's see. Why is it? I princess. A lot of emotion. You can see we have a lot of cups. So cups, yes, talking about emotion and relationship. Where's the eye princess? Whoops. Cups, the ace of wands. So ace of wands, it's a new passion coming in your life. I feel like it's a new relationship, okay, some of you. Oh, it's a new idea. It's about creativity and passion, okay? You are using your intuition. Let's see the Six of Swords. What is the Six of Swords? Okay, you can see. Say, so I Princess again. You are using your intuition to move in a new direction. I'm sorry, to find peace in your life. It's a Queen of Wands. Oh, it's a Queen of Wands. Sagittarius. Like it was empty and now you're feeling good again, okay? Gav, the house, it's your home, your family, your stability. Knight of Cups. Whoops, an opportunity is coming for you. An opportunity with this key can be talking about success, okay? It's a new door open for you, Sagittarius. For some of you, it's an opportunity to have stability in your relationship. There's a six of pentacles. You're going to make a decision. It's a crossword in your life. Oops. 
So is a lipstick curl here. How about your future? I like you're going to move in a new place, a new city, a new country, something new, okay? Where is the two of pentacles? The moon again. The moon, it's your intuition. And this deck is also talking about your repetition. Okay. Let's see. Why is the eye princess? Why is the eye princess? The Sagittarius. That's a book. Some secret here. But I feel like you know what's going on because the eye princess, she knows everything. Okay. And the Six of Swords. Where is the Six of Swords for Sagittarius? It's a man. Mm. For some of you, you are going to move to be with this person. Okay. The last message. This success can be also success in your relationship, okay? That's a child. That's a child you will have the moon twice. Be careful, okay? Because the moon is talking about fertility. So child is talking about a new beginning also. Cups of fall here. Whereas this turns horizon is like a dream come true. It's coming for you, Sagittarius. And we have a heal for men. We like it's this man. This person has a good job, good situation. And I feel like this person wants to be with you, okay? There is a lot of love here. You can see we have the three of pentacles. The three of pentacles is a collaboration, teamwork. This person wants to work with you, wants to have stability with you. A home. Some of you my ash here, okay? Sagittarius, this is your reading for the next week. Thank you so much for watching and being here. Take care.